Hi all. Today I'll show you how you can install Javix 6.0, okay? 6.0 on CentOS 8, okay? So let's start on VM. I will try to install, okay? Javix server 6.0. So we'll go to here. This take longer than. Oh. Go to EC2 dashboard. No. Let's take Javix. No. Let's type send to S8. And find the user sent to us. Okay. Now let's add the pimp key. Here you go. Now Pseudo spaces here. Now we'll go to our this portal. Okay. Now we'll copy this command.
ya. Now let's start Maria Devi. Okay. This is done. Let's connect to my circle. Okay, connected. Now let's create a database. One row created. Now create a user. Sorry. Now we have created a user Javix. Now we are giving a Privilege Okay. This is also done. Now Okay. This is done. Let's get. Okay, now we'll go this path. And let's see the okay, now let's see the my SQL ls okay yeah jet cat will do here we'll do jet cat jet cat zero dot excel pipe my sql javix okay Hardly it will take two to three minutes. Just done. Now, what we need to do is now if you do my sql okay then you try so database this is oh. so so did Okay, huge Javix is coming. So tables. Okay. Then Let's exit from here, okay? CD. Let's do your install group. Yeah. 
Steam is installed. No. Okay. Now we will install. Now go to this file. CD is etc. Go CD slash etc slash Jabix. Then enter ls Javix server. So vim Javix server dot com file. Okay, here and database as a password. DB name is a Javix, DB user. Javix, DB. Uh -huh. We should use DB password as a password. Insert mode. Where is the DB password here? DB password as a password. P A D O S T O P A R D. Okay. Small password. Okay. Escape. Look here. Escape. Mark. Done. Now we'll do get in force. Which is here set a set in force zero. Now get in force. You try should show permission. Okay. Now we will install HTTPD. Nothing to do. Let's enable this paste. This is also done. Was it uh, system detail enable firewall D? System CTL enable firewall D. Start. Okay. Firewall is enabled. Now should be added this port. Success. This is better. We'll add this one. Okay. Success. Now stop firewall D again. Start and enable. Okay. System CDL enable HTTP dot service. Symlink is created. Again, we restart HTTP D service. Is running now. Let's run this command. Okay. Now 
you should try this link. What is that server IP? Control V. Javik server is installed. Next step. Next should be MySQL. Password is password. Open host you can give. Javik server name, you can give the IP. Okay, next. Next, here you go, finish. Admin, Javix. Username will be by default admin. Now you see, Javix server is not running and we are asking, they're asking to upgrade your database. Right, so how you can upgrade the database? Correct, so what we need to do is, let's search it, how to upgrade, um, Maria DB 10.3 to 10.5. There's no, this will also not help you. So how to upgrade a database? No. How to upgrade MariaDB 10.3 to 10.5 in CentOS 8? Okay. Take this one. Hmm. Now How to upgrade Maria Devi? So first, you should create a you go this directory. CD paste. Now LS will do yam repos dot D then Maria DB dot repo. There will be
vim create with the repo. Paste, okay. Insert mode. Copy this. Paste it. Okay. Escape colon WQ. Okay. This is done. Then we'll do, do DNF repo list. Maria DB. Okay. Till to start, Maria TV 10.5 server. Hmm. See, Maria TV is running. So now we'll go to our here. Let's refresh. Here you go. Java server is running. So now in this video, what you understood is how you can install Javix server 6.0 and uh, 
how to upgrade a MariaDB database, okay? Because of, I have seen that a lot of people are facing difficulty to upgrade the MariaDB, okay? So to upgrade a MariaDB, nothing you need to do that. You should follow this link, okay? You should, uh, what you need to do is, you should uh, create on repo in this directory, mariadb.repo and add this file, key file, jpg key file, okay? Then you check for repo list. You can see the MariaDB. Uh, then you install the MariaDB. And once you install the MariaDB, you'll get face some difficulty, but you can, once you use this command, where it go? When you should allow, okay? So once you allow, here you can go. You can, you should use this one, okay? Allow raising, okay? So once you did this one, you can install, then first you enable, then you start the MariaDB, okay? It'll work. If you start the MariaDB, you face some difficulty. So first you enable the MariaDB, then you start the MariaDB, okay? Once you start automatically, then you check the status, it will show running and your MariaDB will be upgraded, okay? Then you, you want to reload the firewall all those things, you can do that, okay? Now you can see the Java server is up now. Okay. Now let's install the Javix agent. So where you can go for agent, click here. So I have Javix agent for six zero. Platform, you can take a Linux. Okay. Now you can use either you can use through wget, no? Download, you can. Okay, in the next video, I'll show you how you can install the Javix agent. Okay. That's it for this lecture. Thank you. Bye.